Well, the future is here when it comes to Metrolink. Test runs for its first zero emission train are about to begin in San Bernardino. KCAL's Joy Benedict is giving us a preview. We all know the sound and what it leaves behind, but what if there was a quieter and cleaner version of your commute? I think it's great. That's where the world is going. It's a dream one step closer to reality in San Bernardino. As folks boarding the Metrolink could see the future just down the track, a hydrogen-powered zero-emissions train. No, it's good for the planet. I, I cannot wait to ride it. If it's going to cut back on the smog in the area, then that's what we need. It's called Zemu, and it arrived a couple of weeks ago after five years of planning. It's the first of its kind in the United States. Tim Watkins is with the San Bernardino County Transportation Authority. Stoller, the manufacturer, uh, was already in this space in Europe. And so we said, can we do this here in the U.S. using the guidelines here in America? A project built out of need for this community. We exist in one of the worst air quality attainment areas in the country, and so we couldn't settle for diesel. This $20 million train was manufactured in Europe. Shipped to the U.S. and spent the last year at the Federal Railroad Testing Facility in Colorado, where it established a new world record, traveling 1,700 miles on a single fueling of a hydrogen fuel cell. I think it ran for almost 46 hours continuous. Here in California, it will only need to go nine miles, at least at first, to Redlands and back, but eventually they want to use this train everywhere. It allows us to go to a cleaner option, which is better for the future. Although the train is officially here, it's not quite ready for passengers yet. There's still a lot of testing that needs to be done, but they're hoping to have it in operation by 2025. The crews are out there looking at the system right now to make sure everything's working fine. We have to work at braking systems and sound systems, communication devices. But it is on track to be the newest and cleanest ride on rails. Joy Benedict, KCAL News.